Hey guys, it's Taylor. So today I'm just going to be doing a my experience video because today I met Bethany Moda. So basically what happened was everyone knows she's on her motivator tour right now. But um basically what happened was the night before I was having a sleepover with my friends and she announced that she's going to be at my mall that I go to every single day of practically my life like that is the mall that I go to for my clothes so I was like are you kidding it's like 10 minutes away from my house so it's like really close to my house and I was like are you kidding me Bethany Moda is gonna be there and so basically me and my friends just decided you know we're gonna go even though it was snowing at my house the roads were really bad and so it was like bad to be out on the roads but I still went anyways because I really wanted to meet her so basically she said she was going to be there from 10 to 12 in the morning and I got there at about 9 ish and there was already a huge long line that was across the whole entire span of my mall and so we were like oh my god there's no way we're going to meet her you know this is like crazy you know like there's no way in heck so basically what happened was we were waiting and waiting 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 and then I met up with Nazin I'll link her YouTube channel below she and her friend Peyton came and met up with us and then we were all waiting in line together and then Nazin went to get Starbucks and I don't know Nazin's experience but I guess she got to meet um, Bethany's mom in Starbucks, so I don't really know anything more about that. I don't know if she's going to post a video like this or anything, but basically, Nazan got to meet her mom in Starbucks, and there's two Starbuckses, Starbuckses, Starbucks in our mall, so she went to the one that Bethany's mom was at, and I went to the other one. The other one just happened to be closer to where we were in line, so I'm not sure why Nazan went to the other one, but she was lucky because she got to meet her mom. So, I will, like, put a picture of the line that we were waiting in at the very beginning. I didn't really get, like, a very clear picture of it, but I have a, I can show you the picture I have of that. And I can show you the line for Starbucks. I was in the Starbucks line for 45 minutes. That's how long it was. And it was like, there's too many white girls in this facility right now. Like, come on now. So, that was a little insane. I was texting my mom, and she was saying, like, why are you waiting that for Starbucks that long? And I'm like, I need caffeine right now, because I was so tired. I was just like starting to lose hope really fast because she was only supposed to be there till 12 and we moved like 5 feet in um, 30 minutes. So basically Nazan got some of her other friends that I knew too and they were all waiting in line together and then one of my other friends from school and one of my dance friends, we met up with them and they were here for a little bit then they left because I wanted to try to like see her bus and my other friends saw my, the, her bus while I was in Starbucks didn't get to see it so that's really upsetting but oh well and um also, she, so we were basically waiting in line for a really, really, really long time after that and probably waiting for like 45 minutes and then we got all the way to the Aeropostal store and um, she was still, you know, in there and basically we were talking to a security guard and he said that there's a really good turnout here and so she wants to try to meet everyone. So she basically met everyone but like 20 people and so I felt really bad for those like 20 people but um... So she was supposed to originally stay till 12, but she stayed till 1 actually because there were so many people that she had to meet. So we got there probably and got to meet her around probably like, um, uh, probably like 12, 10 ish. And she was, the, they had like a ton of security guards and everything. And once we got like past these red ropes that pretty much guaranteed that you're going to meet her. So they had the red ropes set up and we were in the red ropes. And then they had like a part where, you know, the, it's almost like a club where they would let you in at a certain point so they'd say how many you would say the number of your group and you'd go in and wait like for a little bit and basically there was a lady who was telling us there that there's so many people she wanted to meet that we couldn't like talk or take pictures for a long time so basically we had to have our phones out ready and we went up to her you know you got to hug her and take a picture with her and then you're done so it wasn't like a huge meet and greet I just got to basically be in the same room with her and take a picture with her so it wasn't like anything super special like that so yeah I mean Basically, we were waiting for like two seconds, pretty much. I went up to her, I gave her a hug, and she said, Oh, I really like your shirt. I'll insert a picture of the two of us somewhere in here. And um, I took a picture, and that was pretty much it. And we just left right after that. So it was a really fast experience, and I waited three hours to see her for like a minute. So I don't know if I would do that again, but I mean, it was pretty fun meeting her and she was super nice and friendly. And one thing that I don't think shows up in her videos a lot is that she has acne too. And so when I saw that, I was like very happy to know that, um, if you probably have watched my acne tag, 
I have had, you know, bad experience with acne, so I was like, oh, thank God I'm not alone in this situation. There's another YouTuber. So that made me feel better and more comfortable about it. But that was one thing that I got out of the whole experience that I was happy about. And, of course, I got to meet her and take pic uh, take uh, three pictures I think I have with her. So that's really fun, too. So then after that, we just went to Annie Ann's and I got four pretzels. And, yeah. That was pretty much my day. It was just a, it wasn't like some crazy fangirl experience or anything. It was just like a quick little meet and greet. So, yep. And no wonder why we celebrate. Hold up, you ain't invited, homie. You can make a cake, cake, cake.